Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in today's video we are here back inside a build a boat once again and today we are going to be going over every single new item inside of this Halloween update that just got added and I just want to tell you guys right now make sure you guys go on my channel and watch my other videos that I posted on this update after you watch this one because I posted a ton of really really awesome videos that you guys will find very very helpful I promise you so make sure you guys go ahead and check that out after you watch this and also make sure you guys go Go ahead and drop a like on the video if you guys are excited and if you are enjoying this brand new update and also make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you guys want to stay updated with everything going on in build about whether it's new items new glitches uh literally everything new secrets all that stuff make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe and turn on that notification bell but without further ado we are going to hop straight into the video because there has been a lot of stuff that has gotten added inside of this update now the first thing that i want to show you guys is the two main items that got added okay now those two main items are the hourglass and also the um the red candy so you guys can see right here the new candy got added it's the red candy now this candy right here is pretty cool if we click on it right here it just grows you like this and it makes you heavier as well so uh, i think it's really cool because you turn into an absolute giant and uh, <laughs> i think it's pretty funny but anyway you guys can see right there that is what the red candy does and how you guys actually get the red candy i made a video on that so make sure you guys go ahead and check it out now nah, i'm just kidding you don't have to go watch it but anyway you guys want to get the red candy it's uh you just go do the map thing just like like this boom you can see right there completed i have finished all of them also if you guys want to figure out all of the candy locations i made a video on that as well make sure you guys go ahead and check it out if you guys want to figure out where all the locations for the candy are at but anyway that's the red candy right there that's one of the main items of the update now i'm going to show you guys the hourglass item now we predicted this right it was in fact the hourglass i had a hard time believing it at first but after i saw it for a while it started to look like an hourglass and what do we know it is an hourglass so you can see right here and place that thing down and uh if we actually we go on the property tool just like this and you can see delay time right here you can set a timer right here for delay time so if it's a four second delay time i think i can set this up with like a thruster or something so let's go like this and put a thruster down so like it's like a timed block basically so if we go like this make this uh anchor off and if we click on the, the thruster oh wait whoops i didn't mean to do that I, i'm not too sure how this block works i'm trying to figure it out as i'm recording this video so it goes to this right so it's connected Okay, then I delete this, so then I grab this. Okay, I'm still trying to figure this thing out, guys, because it's honestly a super cool block once I figure out how to use it. All right, so what you guys need to do for this, all right, so you have the trail going to the thruster to the hourglass, all right, so then from there, what you guys want to do is you want to grab a switch, okay? Now, the switch connects to the hourglass, and the uh, hourglass connects to the thruster, so everything's connected. So if this is correct, this hourglass says four second delay time, so if I click this, one, two, three, four, boom, the thruster should go forward. I actually love that. That is a very, very good block. I love this. There's gonna be a lot of cool creations done with this. So thank you, Cho Thrill, for adding that. I mean, it looks, I mean, I, I think, I love it. I love it. I love the looks of it. I think it's a great block and it's gonna be good for a lot of creations and probably some good glitches as well. So stay tuned on the channel for that. But anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into the next items that got uh, added inside of this update. So if you guys didn't know, I made a video on this as well. Now, uh, you guys may know how to actually get these items or you might actually have these items already and what we're going to do is place these all down you can see we have the new staff item and the staff uh got changed so like it does like new effects it's honestly really cool and i like it a lot more than like the lightning strike it used to do like this one is way way better and i love it like i love it a lot so then we have the bow all right the bow i, I believe is the same it's just textured differently so all these are like basically new because you know they're, they're new items you know what i mean all right so like i said the bow is basically just a retexture and then the last thing is the sword now i did a video testing all these out like i said you guys can see right here the sword looks really sick as well great great effects with the sword i like it and i love the design on it as well but anyway you can see right there we got the candy the new swords uh the hourglass and also there's even more swords that got added to the game as well uh if you guys don't know if you've already had these they're actually inside the shop now um where where's it at here exactly uh the pvp pack where where, where did i see it was oh, right here you can see right here uh, I believe the price of this did get lowered as well the swords are actually different in this pack as well so if we go right up here you can see the swords are different right there also the hand cannon is way way different okay if we actually go ahead and grab this and this right here also I believe the pistols right here these things are one tap as well so if we go over here pull up our inventory because we have so much stuff right now it's crazy 
Uh, let me go ahead and drag this here. Let me drag this here and this here. You can see that all these items right here are like retextures of old items. And now the hand cannon, you can hold it like this. Oh my goodness, it looks so sick. Also, the new swords right here, those look cool as well. And the new uh, handguns right here, boop, just like that. And then there's sword as well. But now, let's go ahead and hop into even more Halloween items that did get added inside of this update. So, if you guys didn't know, if you actually go fight the boss fight, all right, you can go over here, press the update button, go to the boss fight. What you guys actually get from there is the dragon harpoon. Now, I did make a video on the boss fight if you guys want to go ahead and check that one out as well. You can see I got the harpoon right here, and basically, it's a re-add, all right? They already added this inside of the game, so they basically re-added this, and basically, it's a harpoon that, like, tracks everything, so, like, if you're trying to shoot at something and it's moving, uh, it'll automatically, like, track it for you, and it's honestly super cool. One of the best items inside of the game, in my opinion, and it's really awesome. So, also, guys, they did add even more stuff to the game, believe it or not. Now, inside of the shop, you guys can see right here, they added a bunch of limited-time Halloween items that have been added for over the the years now you can see right here purchase one candle for 25 gold so uh you guys could probably buy these things because they're probably they're only here for a limited amount of time now the pumpkin right here you can buy that as well and also you can see the pine trees those cost 80 gold those ones are there as well nice looking good and also the dragon harpoons are 300 robux for five of them now you could probably do the boss fight and get five dragon harpoons by doing it for free so unless you don't want to do the boss fight then pay, pay the three grow bucks but you can literally get them for free by doing the boss fight so that's uh that's a little plus right there but anyway um i believe that is all of the items inside of this brand new update unless you're counting the ones that are inside of the plushie room you guys may know the plushie room did get updated with brand new items that are absolutely crazy and uh you guys gotta go ahead and check it out i made a video on it if you guys want to watch it where i dive more in depth on the new plushie room all the new secret items inside of there make sure you guys go ahead and watch that video because that is super cool we have potentially a new tool being added to the game and i'm i'm just very very excited for it now we don't know when that tool is going to be added or if it for sure is a tool we have no idea but there's some very, very interesting stuff in there that you guys have to go ahead and look at. But also, let me know down below if you guys find any secrets around the map. Now, I've looked at the map and something just doesn't feel right. I feel like there's something around the map that we're not picking up on. And I feel like there's a big secret that's... Um, that, that's hiding from us, okay? I can feel it. I feel there's a secret, but I'm not too sure what it could be or where it could be. So, comment down below if you guys find any secrets. Thank you guys all so much for watching the video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys go ahead and drop a big thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so that way you guys get notified whenever a new update or secret or glitch or new items come out to build about. Thank you guys all so much. I'll see you on to the next one. Have a great day as always, guys. Peace out and goodbye.